Hey everyone, um, Elite Sports, a gi manufacturer, reached out to me and asked if I could do a review of one of their products, one of their gis, in exchange for um, that gi. So what I have here for you is one of Elite Sports A3s, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu gis. Okay. Um, when they first reached out, the first thing I was worried about um, was the length. The length of the skirt of the jacket, the length of the sleeve, and the length of the inseam in the pants. And the last three gis that I've bought, I've been very disappointed in the lengths of either one of those three areas in terms of the length. Um, so I was very nervous when this product was going to arrive, how it would fit me. Um, I was very pleasantly surprised. Um, the inseam fit me, the sleeve length fit me, the length on the skirt of the jacket fit me. Um, I'm 6'2", about 190 to 210, depending on the time of the year. Um, so I got an A3, and it fit me very well. Um, what's noticeable about that, or rather what's notable about that, is I have another friend who also got an A3. And he's much shorter than me. Well, not much shorter, but I'd say like uh, three, four, th three to five inches shorter than me, and wider as well. He also got an A3, and it fit him as well. Okay, so something about this cut, it's more versatile. So I wouldn't say it's necessarily tailored, like some geese are, um, but it's a little bit more of a versatile cut. So depending on your size, there's a good chance it will fit you. Okay, um, next thing you want to know about this gi, okay, it's a pearl weave, so it's light. Okay, um, my lightest gi is about three and a half, three point six 3.6 pounds, and this thing is four pounds. Okay, my, my heaviest gi is about five and a half. So this is on the lighter end of, of, um, of geese. It's advertised as lightweight, and I'd say it feels like that as well. When you wear it, it's very mobile. Uh, you feel mobile in it, um, so it's not very heavy, okay? Uh, but you do have a very durable foam collar, so it's not a flimsy, lightweight gi, if that's something you're concerned about, okay? Another good thing about this is the price. Honestly, this marks, uh, this is on the market at $70, okay? And for $70, uh, I don't know if you can get a better gi than this, okay? Um, it's great for, I'd say, if you're a, uh, a beginner and you're looking for an entry-level gi, you can't really get better than this right now, as far as I know, on the market for that price. Also, in terms of travel gis, if you're traveling for competitions or you're traveling and you want to do some jiu-jitsu when you're traveling for work or something, this is great. It's lightweight. It packs up really small. Um, and in terms of the price, if you're looking for a gi just specifically to travel, this is probably your best bet as well, okay? Uh, moving on, in terms of like aesthetics, which is very important to us, right? Um, very clean. It's got this clean look. It's got plenty of room for patches, which I plan on putting on shortly. Um, put some Carlson patches on. I'm excited to do that. Um, here are the pants. The pants are ripstop, and they've got one of these nice rope drawstrings, right? Which we like on our gi pants. Very good, easy to put in there. Um, easy to not get stuck. And they untie very uh, very well as well. And we got, you see that ripstop material in there? Okay, good rip -mop, good ripstop material. Um, what else? I got some notes here. Oh yeah. Free white belt, right? Who doesn't know a white belt in need, right? So I'm planning on donating this in the future elite keys that I get, donating the white belts to uh, white belts in need, because we all know one of them, right? Uh, what else do we got? Oh yeah, okay, so the white, the white is $70, and I think the blue one is as well, but they also have a black, a navy, and a, um, and a gray, and those are $80, okay? Um, I think that's it. Um, I'm loving it so far. This is probably going to be my uh, competition gi and travel gi in the near future. Uh, I'm going to be traveling to Nova Scotia and Newfoundland later in this year. Um, so I think it's zombie jiu-jitsu. We're going to hit you up later in October. So we'll see you then. Okay? Anyway, this is Pat for Elite Sports. Uh, try one of the gis out. I liked it a lot. Thank you. See ya.